get a bucket and a mop for this. Yeah, you know the song. I don't care about 95% of what you're saying. Who needs bending when you got hands? Don't test me because I'll turn you to dust. Watch your man sit because I apply pressure. <laughs> Please. Azula, you already know what I give, baby. I told you we not here for that. After all these years, you're still a traitor. Call it what you will, but I'm trying to bring peace among us. And you, and you are interfering with the healing that can take place here. I'm seriously sick of fighting. We're all connected through some type of friendship. And the fact that we're grown women and we can't get along is embarrassing. We're going to talk through our issues or you're going to lose the feeling in your limbs. Simple. Period, Tylee. Get these hoes um, together. What are a couple non-benders gonna do to me? I'll answer that. Nothing. You got that? Tom. Tighten up, ho. No, y'all tighten up. No, y'all tighten up. A little too you tighten up for me. Don't talk like you could beat my ass. Tighten because up, you couldn't do that in your dream. Them badger moles that you smell like. Without bending? Without bending. Straight hands. You might be the earthbender, but I'll rock your world in this so motherfucker. Rocky. Keep playing with so me. So rocky. Keep on. So rocky. Aw, it's Team Avatar having a civil war. What happened to you guys? Azula, Tylee has put your arms on melatonin twice now. Worry about your own civil war, bitch. It's obvious the seeds I planted at my welcome home party are beginning to germinate. Lovely. Are you all really fighting over a man? How pathetic. Girl, you fumbled the only man to even want you. You're pretty. Together, you and I will be the strongest couple in the entire world. We will dominate the Earth! Ah, uh, I gotta go. So who really put that in? Your grandmother for one. Bitch! <sighs> really? Really? <laughs> <laughs> Finally, you've done something useful with your sad life. Azula, stop talking to me like that. Stop talking to everyone like that. I may have worked in a circus, and I may not be royalty, but I'm a much better person than someone who feels good about herself because she makes everyone else feel bad. And I'll take that any day. Is that from Cam Brock? Ty Lee. Shut the fuck up with this Sesame Street shit! I'm so sick of being subjected to you idiots. I'll have no more of it. I won't be threatened with hospitalization any longer. The next time we meet, it'll be on different terms. Where are you going? Home for the night, then to see my brother. <sighs> yeah, I'ma head out too, cause I don't wanna have to smack one of y'all cause y'all mouth too slick. Oh, um, do you need any assistance? Assist these nuts. Well, how about some s'mores? Aang being the avatar knows everything about me. And when my spirit is in turmoil, he knows it immediately. No matter how I try to hide it. Katara? Don't even think about bringing that animosity into our home. Aang, I don't feel- Katara, please don't make this an issue. Come. He won't even let me around the kids, especially Tenzin, if my body and mind aren't at peace. Has anyone checked on Tenzin since you started meditating? Tenzin is napping, and his spirit is happy. He's doing much better than you are right now. Well, I've been gone all night. I would like to see him, Kaya, Boomy. Not happening. Not in the state you're in. I'll be fine once I can see the kids. And you'll be even better once we align your spirit. Now get ready, it's non-negotiable. <sighs> Thank you. Now think of meditation as an energy converter. Yes, you see energy cannot, cannot be, be created or destroyed, only transferred or converted. Exactly. If you didn't want the lecture, you should have just done what was required. Now, 
If we have negative energy within us and we do not convert it into positive energy, then it will be transferred to those around us. So we will always meditate when needed for the sake of our family. Understood? Yes. Now, who or what is the source of this unwelcomed energy? Azula, May, and Toph. Toph? Yes. What have they done? They disrespected me and my home. How? By calling me a commoner in my home ghetto. Aang? Yes. Do you believe these things to be true? Not at all. You are the daughter of the chief of the Southern Water Tribe, no? Yes. And what does that make you? Royalty. Exactly. Now let's end with three positive affirmations. Um, I miss kind. I um, miss, um, I miss small. What is this grammar? And I'm is important. Woo! Dang right you are. Whew. Do you feel better? I do. Thank you. No problem. I love you. I love you too. Now, where my baby? Dibs on playing with Tizzy. I've been put on a leash by dogs who are beneath me for the last time. So it's high time I find Zuko and get this hospital collar off of my neck. Zuko! Zuko! Azula! 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 Ridiculous, right? That's how you sound. Why are you yelling? I'm here to discuss the way I've been treated since I've returned from that god-awful facility. Okay, what's the issue? The issue is it constantly being dangled over my head as a means of control and punishment. Yeah, because you're dangerous to the people around you. Some degree of control is needed. What have you done with my brother? Where is the... My honor. Zuko. He would never treat me this way. That Zuko is still here. He's the guy giving you the freedom you How have How is now. this freedom? Constantly worried about being put in a straitjacket is hardly living. I've hardly lived my entire childhood thanks to you and father. Yet, I still show both of you grace to this day. Ah, so it's resentment. You're holding a grudge against me. Zuzu may be Fire Lord, but the sad little boy with the barbecue eye is still in there longing to be loved by his family. And I intend to exploit that. I'm not holding a grudge. You just have to mind your words and actions. This is all you do. Don't say this or this is going to happen. I'm tired of your rules. Rules? You mean the law? I'm tired of you controlling me. It's not going to continue. Control you? How do I control? Zuko, are you stupid? Zuko constantly threatens me with the facility if I don't play by his rules. And it's good he has somewhat of a backbone, but he can't use it on me. So, so what do you need to feel free? The throne. Huh? What do you mean? What I just said. What are you, crazy? I'm sorry, but are you telling me my authority means nothing to you? After all I did for you? You haven't done anything for me. Oh, okay. I ain't, do, you I ain't chance, do nothing for you. Nothing. I gave you another life. A better life. Better than it was under father's rule. All you do is tell me when I don't do what you say is, oh, I'm going to send you back to the hospital. You know what you tell me? I gave you this life. Okay, and if you gave me this life and you're going to take it back every chance you get, I don't need you to give me no fucking life. Zula, stop. You say that shit every time you get mad and every time something don't go your way, the first thing you say is, I'm going to send you back to the fucking hospital. Azula, don't. You would never send me back to the hospital because I'm not going back. And I don't want you to go back. Yes, you do. No, I really don't. And I won't threaten you that way again. I apologize. Swear to me that I don't have to go back. I swear to you, you will not be sent back to any hospital facilities. <laughs> Perfect. You're the best, Zuzu. I was planning on having you start in-house treatment anyway. Nice try, Zuzu. I'm not that gullible. I'm glad you ladies could join me here today. Twinkle Toes gathered everybody for a sit down, but my feet are tired of looking at these. What is she doing here? This is my interview room, Ray Charles. Get your ass out. Katara has informed me that there is still discourse amongst you all, and it's disheartening to me that you all would stoop so low as to talk about each other's mental health or birthplace. You told your husband on us? I told him about y'all. But I didn't tell him to do this. I'm here on my own accord because it's ridiculous that grown women cannot behave as such. Twinkle Toes, you barely know how to behave as an adult, much less a woman. Not now, Tom. 
You all need to sit and talk through your issues and then apologize and move forward. Just think of me as the mediator. <sighs> now y'all don't have anything to say. The avatar shows up and you all go silent. Man, shut the fuck up. No. No cursing, please. You the one who unleashed the Tasmanian devil at the camping trip. May in her stiff ass voice box let Azula do whatever she wanted to do the other night. She the reason things got out of control. You fucked up the trip, so, so you talk. The cursing. Please. May, I'm the reason. The Kyoshi headwear must be squeezing your head too tight. Katara started all of that. Katara didn't attack anyone. Well, technically... Tom, whose side are you on? My side. This is my mouth. I already can't see. Y'all not finna disable my mouth, too. She the op at this point. What's wrong? Can't decide if you all want to be friends? No, we can. And we definitely don't need help from you, considering you can't even decide on a hairstyle. May has pigtails, two braided buns, Chinese bangs, and sideburns. Like, girl... Go to hell. Okay, hold up. Let's not all attack May. Katara, you did come for her for no good reason. I had to get my lick back from the party. You got your lick back while we were there. Why the fuck did you have to start it back up? Ladies, language. Because I still felt a way about being called a commoner. Because it never gave that. Oh, it gave that. Never. Y'all were sleeping in igloos. That's as common as it gets. Child, what am I explaining myself to a sidekick for? Excuse me? What the fuck did you think you were? Because you were Azula. also a sidekick. You couldn't even teach the boy bending like Zuko in the all seen foot. Are you dumb? I did teach him. Nothing useful until you all met Paku. And even then, if he would have paid attention, he could have mastered water without you completely. Sounds like a sidekick to me, bitch. Come on, Azul. Bitch, 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 bitch. Fuck you, bitch. I'm tired of your egghead ass too. Who the fuck are you talking to? <sighs> the bald headed scallywag. Bitch, don't talk to him like that. I will talk to him however I like. No, you gonna talk to him like you got some sense. Like he the avatar. And what reason do I have now to give a damn about something I have never given a fuck about? I don't give a single damn about the avatar. I hunted the avatar and killed him. So why would I not talk to him like any other person? Because that's my man, and you don't want me to put my hands on you. I would actually love that. You wouldn't, especially while Zuko not around. <laughs> when has Zuko ever needed to save me? Uh, and Ba Sing Se, when I had you locked down with the Aquapus? Oh yeah, the Aquapus you were trying to give to my brother in that cave? Bitch, wasn't nobody finna fuck Zuko. I was just trying to fix his deep fry eyeball. <laughs> Bitch, don't ever disrespect my husband. <laughs> Nobody disrespecting him, baby. I'm telling it like it is. Ooh, I smell chaos on the horizon. And Zuko took the chains off of me as well. <laughs> Let's push this over the edge. Tell your truth without letting your mouth get loose. I said like what I said. Pussy. Like your pussy. Bitch, you're a loser. Shut the fuck up. Avatar, you know Zuko told me he had sex with the water tribe slut. What? Bitch! Don't start lying. I mean, he don't said it was good. Don't fucking lie on so me, bitch. That. Don't do that. Don't you tell no fucking lie on me. You can ask him. Azula, shut up. Azula is a bold-faced liar. It's blatant and obvious that she's just looking for a reaction. And the water rat is probably gonna give up. Oh, if I could get my hands on you, bitch. Let me go. <laughs> Thank you, but Please I'm not let a let me go lesbian. Just for 20 seconds. You know what? Please. I'm starting to think everything you say is a lie. Wow. Nothing gets past a skill fighter like you. Katara, you're better than this. I'm not, Aang. I promise I'm not. You don't have to stoop to her level. I know, but I want to. Let me go, Aang. Ah, <sighs> oh, shit. Enough. I will not allow you to sit here and tarnish the peace Zuko and I have brought to the nations and Republic City. You all will sit here until you can find understanding amongst each other. Hmm. Since we're reminiscing on Ba Sing Se, why don't we relive the moments? Now behave like... Did you blood bend me? I did, bitch. You thought you was finna get that shit off? Did you just try to kill me? I thought we were reliving Ba Sing Se. What's wrong? Bitch, it's taking all of me not to touch you right now. <sighs> it feels good to finally be free. Okay, hold up. Let's not all attack May. Sakura.